yours i have shown you how to get a free domain name and web hosting now i will show you how to build your website with uh, bibli website builder bibli okay you have to type bibli in the google and you will be directed to the bibli dot bibli.com Okay, you can uh, web, uh, use the Vivli website builder to build your website and you can get the source of your website which you can upload to your web hosting service provider. Okay, so now I will, uh, you can sign up for the Vivli. I have already signed up so I will uh, add a website. Okay, go for the option add a website. Okay, it will ask you do you want to sell online that means you have to make a commercial websites like Amazon Flipkart but uh, I don't want to make any so not now if you want to make you can go for yes option okay so the, here are the some of the simple themes for the simple websites I will select this and here you have to click on start editing okay, so you can be able to edit your websites now it's loading okay now here there are the three options register a new domain name. that is you can register a new domain name but it will be charged you use a domain you already own that is you have registered your domain name from any domain register but you can use it here but you have to first transfer it to the Weebly and then you can use it so it is also chargeable now you can use freely a subdomain of Weebly.com okay so we will go for the third option we will use subdomain of Weebly.com freely ok ok so now I have typed a one domain name subdomain and here it shows it is available so you can further continue ok now so you can now edit your website your title okay, you can give any title it means cool stops and all okay and then after that you you have done you can publish your website okay use a subdomain of every you can publish okay so here your website is published as a be cool stuff dot dot com okay now if you want the source of your website so you can go to the settings in a Weebly ok by scroll down here you have the option archive that means create a dot zip archive of your site you will get a dot zip archive that means a source of your site and you have to enter there your email id ok ok email id i will enter in my email id email seven you can enter yours and then here you have to select the option email the archive ok so now within a few minutes you will get your archive mailed to your email ok we will see mm, we need to refresh so by using these steps you can get the source of your website which you have built with Weebly website builder you can get the source and you can upload at your free hosting providers ok 
the space is already provided to you by your free web hosting providers for your website storage so you can use this source and upload it there so you don't have to bother about any website builder that uh, your service provider provides or not okay so you will get your email archive to your email id we'll see Okay, I will refresh this one. Anything that shows, we will see that. If re refreshing this, okay, I will try for second time. Okay, I will copy this one and paste it here. So it won't get any deflections from the real email IDs. again yeah okay so it will be there somewhere it will take a few minutes or an hour to reach your to your gmail okay but you can download it from here here it shows recent exports so you can click on this and you can download the winzip file you can save it okay and then you can get the source of your website which you can put on your web hosting service providers storage and you your website will be live okay. thank you for watching this video and if you like this video click on the like button if you want me to make another videos like this you can subscribe to my channel and if you want any specific videos uh, which you think that i can make so you can put it in the comment box. Thank you.